Brian, you are caring and patient, and you make Allie the very best version of herself. Thank you for being the perfect match for my best friend. Ordinarily, this would be the moment where I tell you to take care of her. But after getting to know you these past three years, I know that's exactly what you're going to do. So if everyone can please raise their glass. Um, stop, actually stop, 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 stop. Um, <laughs> if you cannot see this screen behind you, you might wanna um, come out to the front here a little bit. There is someone that couldn't make it today that would like to say congratulations. Allie, what up? It's your boy, Lil John. Just want to say congratulations to you and Brian. Pet Boomer for me. You guys made the big step. You're married, man. Get out of your mind. Yeah. So, the one request I have for you guys is that you got to dance to get low at your wedding ceremony. Yeah! Cheers to Mr. and Mrs. Hassan! Turn to this way. Yep. Okay. Oh my god. Beautiful. Because like you're going to trip at least once on that. Probably. <laughs> but look at my shoes. You are wearing those. <laughs> I thought that was a joke. No. Oh my God. Well, we met on Bumble. <laughs> Actually declined him on Tinder, but accepted on Bumble. <laughs> One day we went to Oscars and it was a legit blizzard. It was supposed to be a quick date, and then three hours later, a snowstorm like started, and his roommate, Chad, who's in the wedding, was like, dude, where are you? <laughs> it snowed like six inches while we were there. She told me that when she and Brian met, they sat and talked for hours, and before I knew it, she was updating me on the many dates that followed. Once I finally met Brian, I could see why Allie was so happy. By watching Allie and Brian together, it is clear how much they love each other. One of the things that hit me very deeply today is the friends and family and the warmth. And this is just wonderful because it's something we've been wanting. Now this fire we got started. Oh my gosh. Oh. Up the sky. So proud of you. Ever since that blizzard first date at Oscars, I knew this day might come. The more I got to know you, the more time I spent with you, the more I knew this day would come. Every day before you, I was holding down. If you want the stars, We've been through so much these last few years. 2020 was a tough year, and if we can navigate that, we can get through anything. You are caring, thoughtful, goofy. <laughs> Which is why I contribute to why I fell in love with you to begin with. So what? <laughs> Words can't begin to describe how lucky I am to have you. I therefore pronounce that you are husband and wife. May God bless you and keep you and give you his peace. Amen. And what God has joined together, let man not separate. Brian, you may kiss your bride. Dear friends, it gives me great privilege to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Brian Hudson.
What up, Phil? Yeah. He's gonna blow over. That's gonna be a problem. Get in here, Phil. Allie and I were casually talking on the phone one day, and I said, what's Brian up to? They were living together at this point, and so what's, what's your roomie doing? Allie goes on to tell me, like it was the most normal thing possible. Oh, um, Brian's, he's sitting outside. He, it's a really nice day. He felt bad that the plants were in. So he took them outside um, for a bit and gave them some water and he's just gonna sit for him, with them for a little while. Thank goodness you now have Boomer to take on walks, so you don't have to do that anymore. Now, as many of you know, I actually don't call Brian by his name. Uh, instead, I call him Grumpy. Uh, I don't really have the time to explain that nickname, uh, but instead wanted to present Allie with her own grumpy starter pack. Got you your own oversized white tees. This is gonna make him happy. I got you a bottle of ranch. And yes, these are pizza rolls. Yeah. 